In this video, we're going to go over fermentation. Fermentation is the anaerobic degradation of glucose to produce ATP. This is in contrast to aerobic respiration, where oxygen is used to break down glucose to form ATP. Now, the role of oxygen is to serve as the final electron acceptor in the electron transport chain. This is important in order to regenerate NAD plus from NADH. Without NAD+, glycolysis cannot run. So in anaerobic conditions, if oxygen cannot serve as the final electron acceptor, that means some other molecule has to serve as the electron acceptor to regenerate NAD plus from NADH. We're going to look at two different types of fermentation, lactic acid fermentation and ethanol fermentation. Lactic acid fermentation are performed by muscle cells during periods of vigorous physical activity. During these activities, oxygen is being used so quickly that the cells are under hypoxic conditions. And when there's low or no oxygen, they have to perform fermentation to produce energy in order to maintain that activity. Here, pyruvate serves as the electron acceptor. And as you can see in this diagram, what happens in lactic acid fermentation is that pyruvate is reduced to lactate and NADH is oxidized to NAD+. And this is catalyzed by the enzyme lactate dehydrogenase. Using this reaction, we're able to regenerate NAD+, so that way we can continue to run glycolysis to produce ATP. We should also note here that lactate is released into the blood where it is eventually going to be converted back to glucose by the liver. Ethanol fermentation is performed by yeast cells. As you can see in this diagram, there are two steps in ethanol fermentation. First, pyruvate is broken down to acetaldehyde and carbon dioxide. Second, acetaldehyde is reduced to ethanol and NADH is oxidized to NAD+. Again, we're able to regenerate NAD+, so we're able to continue to produce ATP using glycolysis.